please subscribe, like, and click the notification bell. Tamar Braxton, singer, actor, TV host, the sister of the legendary Tony Braxton. Well, she recently shared footage of her car being broken into at her uh, Atlanta apartment. This incident has caused Braxton to actually want to leave Atlanta. She told officers that her car was completely trashed and that um, she was highly pissed and freaked out. And now she wants to move out of her luxury building and start a life somewhere else. But people are wondering, how would she do that? She has a job, a job that's based in Atlanta called Dish Nation. <laughs> and, you know, I mean, with technology, yeah, things are very possible. So, you know, she can stream or Zoom, you know, her part of the show. But, you know, how long will that last? Now, in the video that Tamar shared, there was some suspicious individuals who were seen snatching items out of her Bentley. Braxton went on to say, I got robbed at home. I'm not safe anywhere. I don't know why I keep getting violated. With all of this surveillance in one of the most expensive and exclusive buildings in Atlanta, no one did anything to prevent it. Well, y'all let's look at how slow those people were or the robbers were going like atlanta is known for cars to get stolen and hijacked and she's claiming that she left a lot of items in the car come on tamar really like look look they, they those guys are just standing around completely chilling they are not worried about anything and i've never known the surveillance camera to move as much as that one was moving come on tamar make it make sense what are you trying to hide are you trying to get sympathy or something in advance before the news gets out that jr your white boyfriend has possibly broken up with you he's gotten his cloud off of you and kind of moved on yeah, you know, Jr. Was, was a Brad or a Ken or whatever they want to call him. He had about five or six kids, but nobody was saying anything about Jr. But they during show talk about future Nick Cannon and all of the others. Uh, yeah, he was an attorney who had like a lot of childhood issues and all of this and that. Hmm, Tamar, are you trying to? pave the way or go ahead and gain sympathy from your audience before they find out the truth i mean again maybe he was with his five kids or working um you know i, I tell you what though women will play on other women's emotions to get on their side something is definitely fishy here and i'm not falling for it because Nobody's going to take their time robbing a Bentley. Like they, those kids were literally just standing there having conversation. Let's talk about it in the comments. Do you think this is a bunch of hogwash? Let's talk about it, guys. And don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe, and hit that.